And the ladies are here for another edition of Girl Talk. Glad to see you all here on the Factor Uncensored tonight. So the question is a weird one. This woman apparently has a boyfriend she lives with, and he walks around with his penis hanging out and just a shirt on. And uh, he said he learned to live that way uh, during the pandemic because he's Zooming. All he needs is his top and not his bottom. And she's okay. asking, is she the asshole <laughs> for suggesting he put that thing away? So, Maggie, let's <laughs> begin with you. Who's the <laughs> here? I mean, honestly, I, I'm going to go ahead and say I think she is. Um, me, personally, I wouldn't mind it. I wouldn't mind if my man walked around naked. I mean, at the end of the day, he's right. He works from home. What's the point of putting pants on? Let that man be free willy as long as he wants or Winnie the Pooh as long as he wants. Um, I mean, if that's my man, I'm going to appreciate every part of his body anyway. So I wouldn't mind if I saw something, you know, walk past me and, and I wasn't. What if he walks know, by you and he's like, oh. <laughs> I'm okay with it. <laughs> I'm okay with it. <laughs> oh my God. The things mm -hmm. people are okay with. All right. I don't know about okay that. Right, let's hear from you. Uh, all I got to um, say is there's good naked and there's bad naked. There's good sexy naked and there's bad, ooh, don't do that. That's unsanitary <laughs> naked, you know? That's right. kind of how I sum it up. That's how I sum it up. And and I, I, I don't know if I want my man walking around the house naked just because I like our sexy time. Leave, leave bad naked over there. So you're saying if mm. you're nude all the time, there's nothing special when it's time to be naked. Sexy time, yeah. What are we looking forward to? I mean, you've been walking around the house naked all day. <laughs> but Laura, let's hear from you on this topic. Who's being the I agree with Maggie. I think she's an mainly because he's been doing this since the pandemic started and apparently they've moved in fairly recently. So how well did she vet her boyfriend that she decided to move into his place, not her place, she moved into his place where he was already swinging free. And I, I feel like that's something she would know before she moved in. And if that was a stipulation that she couldn't deal with, she needs to say so. She moved in with this man. It wasn't the other way around. I see well, that. I see that. Well, damn. Let that thing All right. be free. <laughs> All right, Jasmine. Jasmine, are you, the, are you the prude of the group? Um, For me, I am all for nude liberation. If people know me know, I love like new beaches and things like that. I'm not like a nudist. However, at Why don't home, you ever post me, it on Instagram then? Uh, I know, right? None of y'all business. <laughs> I don't none see you nude business, on the beach on Instagram. You know? we saw her I, I, I hug trees and I like water. You know, if you know, you know. You know, it's not fair for social media. Um, but at home, just like walking around for me, that's that's not that's not what I would like to be honest. To have him walk around a t shirt and his things just swinging around poop. everywhere. You we cooking? You no, know, that's even not that's not sexy at all. And then you cooking around and you got like a pubic stuff everywhere. Like I just <laughs> it, that's a no for me. And it's it's not. And I'm like a person that's like to be within my imagination. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. if I just see you dangling around, it's just like mm, yeah, okay, okay, okay. What if you are that? prude type of person where you're like, I just don't like all of this. So how do you resolve that issue if he wants to continue to do it in his house? I mean, when it, I mean, just like any topic in a relationship, it comes to finding that middle ground with your partner. You know, maybe you can walk around naked during certain times of the day or only on your, you know, when you're not on the Zoom call or, or you know, I'm a little bit different when it comes to like saving sexy time. Like, I think that's more of a mental thing. I don't need to see you naked to be turned on or anything like that. Um, so I think being naked and being free, if you want, is fine. But I mean, just finding a middle ground, maybe in the mornings you're, you're naked or you're clothed and then at night you're naked, you know, things like that. But I mean, I'm totally okay with it. I don't think any pubic's going to necessarily fly into the food. Um, <laughs> but if it does, you know, I don't, I don't need no curly Sue's in my food. So but, but if it does, that'd be the last here. time. If that yep. did happen, you'd be telling your man, 
You know what? There is no middle ground. Go put your maybe. pants on. Yeah, <laughs> maybe. It's strange that he's opting to go without underwear. Like, it's not just about not wearing the pants. Let's make it clear. He's not wearing underwear either. He is literally. I want to let you guys know I'm wearing pants, pants right now. <laughs> Same here. <laughs> well, good kids. to see you ladies tonight on Girl Talk. Always good to see you, and we'll see you back here again next week. And wear your bottoms. Wear your bottoms. Wear your bottoms. Bottom. <laughs> <laughs> no Winnie the Pooh. We're going to get Jasmine to post some of those pictures of her new beach activity on Instagram, right? Yes. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Peace. Bye. Bye. Right. Who walks around like that? Uh, you never know. That's going to do it for us tonight. Thanks for being with us this week. You can always catch us on What You Missed on the Isaiah Factor Uncensored on the Fox 26 YouTube channel. We'll see you next week and have a great weekend. Enjoy the cool temperatures. I'm loving it. <laughs>